seemingly without end, the floral tributes have spilled out from Buckingham Palace onto the gardens of Green Park. The crowds, unrelenting, snake their way along a one-way system that no one quite understands, so they just follow the people in front. Volunteers are pressed into action, fetching, carrying, removing plastic packaging. Loving messages remember a queen who was the nation's grandmother. We've been here since about six this morning, just trying to clear the uh, flowers from over near the palace. What we've found since we've been here is we've been completely overwhelmed. Um, we've done 15 trucks so far and everyone's just coming in, giving us a hand. We just look at the people, that they're, they're picking everything up, they're litter picking, they're clearing everything up. Um, it's absolutely fantastic. In the 20 or so years that I've been in horticulture, I've never seen anything like it. It's almost like a kind of pilgrimage, isn't it? Thousands of people coming here, many with a genuine sense of grief, others to have a physical experience of history and to leave their mark. And here in this place, it feels almost universal, like surely everyone must want to be here. But of course, that's not the case. Elsewhere, life goes on largely undisturbed. Respectfully blacked out display windows at one of London's most famous stores serve only to hide the bustle of shoppers inside. A majority generally approve of the monarchy in Britain today, but much of that is down to the popularity of the Queen and her grandchildren. For younger generations, it is an institution with questionable relevance. Personally, it doesn't affect me. I know that might sound a bit insensitive, but I understand the, the significance, but it doesn't have an impact on my life personally. I think that's the general feeling with my friends. I think they're a good, it's good to have like a head of the country, have like a figure to look up to, but I just don't think that is relatable for a lot of people now. God save the king. God save the king. While the new king is proclaimed in places great and small across the country, many simply go about their business. King Charles has work to do to fill his mother's place in the nation's affection. Jonah Hull, Al Jazeera, London.